Hello everyone. So today's topic is uh, billion alarm. How to set your billion alarm for your uh, AWS Cloud Console so that you won't get overcharged and uh, you know what is your threshold value uh, up to which you can pay for it and you will be getting notified once uh, you reach that threshold value. So how do we set it? You need to go to services and go uh, and go to CloudWatch. As the name suggests, CloudWatch it will be monitoring your whole uh, cloud's uh, uh, management system and it will be under management and governance. The second one, CloudWatch. Go in here and you will get in a uh, tab in the left corner, alarms uh, under which you will get in the billing. In billing, you need to click on this create alarm as I'm pointing out. You should not create on this create alarm uh, and uh, th there will be some generic metrics on which it will be creating the alarm. But you need to create an alarm for the whole uh, for your whole AWS account. So you need to go from here. And it this screen should be showing once uh, you create on the create alarm. Uh, if you are not if this screen is not been shown, so uh, you you need to think of uh, in which create alarm you have clicked whether on the downwards on uh, whether on this or this you should not create a uh, click on this you should go ahead with this itself and you can see in here the metric name is estimated charges and the currency in which it will be showing is usd and the period of interval it will be monitoring and uh, sending out data if it just the threshold if, uh, uh, to uh, to check whether it has reached the threshold value or not is six hours. The threshold type is static, and anomaly is if there is an anomaly in uh, your account, and estimated charges is greater than ten US dollar. Let's assume, and let's click on next. There's no uh, no need of going with additional configuration, and. Uh, select an SNS topic. SNS topic is nothing but simple notification service and this will be covered in other videos. Create a new topic right now. And uh, let me give the topic name as Bill Alarm uh, or is estimated charges and the email endpoint See, you can see in here SNS topics can contain only alphanumeric characters, hyphens, and underscores. So, so right now it took means the space should not be there in your SNS topics. Let me give my email id you should provide your email id not mine one once you, whenever you go for your account then create the topic once the topic is created you will be sent a email to verify it and i already received that email Let's click on next or let's go in here and check. If you want, you can go, you can add these things. I'm not adding, I'm just check showing you how to create the billing alarm and Define a unique name. Let me give the name as billing alarm. Your bill has crossed the threshold limit of ten US dollar. And let's next and now create the alarm you can see in here this is pending for confirmation why it is pending for confirmation because we need to we need to 
confirm it via email. The email link which uh, AWS will be providing, we need to confirm in there. Well, this is the email you will be getting. You have chosen to subscribe to the topic this. Uh, to confirm the subscription, please click on the link below. And I need to click in here. And it says my subscription subscription is confirmed. You can see in here. So let's go to the uh, to our cloud management console and refresh it. See, there are no actions to be taken right now. But there is in uh, here you can see this is uh, the state as insufficient data, as you can see in the state and in the uh, in the alarms also. Why is this showing us insufficient data? Because I've just now created it, and more actions you take uh, with uh, more uh, uh, things you browse, more actions you take around this, it will be changing to okay. It will be uh, uh, I mean uh, it will be changing to okay, and it will take around six hours for it to change it to okay so i believe i have and you can see the view alarm from here also and i believe this thing uh, means you are clear with the billing alarm <coughs> sorry how to set it and what all things you can do with it uh, if you have any queries please do uh, send me a comment and i will try to clear it out thanks a lot